Thank you for holding. My name is Jenny. We help you claim your $100 award voucher today. Our calls are recorded for quality assurance. What's your first and last name? Uh, Hello? Yes, my first name is Oba. What is your name? My name is Oba. What is your name? Oba? Yes, ma'am. Hi, thank you. Hi, thank you for holding. My name is Jenny. We helping you claim your one hundred dollars worth of today. It's nice to meet today. you, Jenny. Call My name is Oba. What's the full address you'd like for me to send your word voucher to you? Pardon me. What is the full address you'd like for me to send your word voucher to you? <coughs> you can send it to my house. What, where do you I, live, I'm sir? I'm living in the the West Virginia. Do you know where that is? Your full address, please. Uh, four. One, one, two, L, A, N, C, A, S, T, E, R, Avenue, Charleston, Miss Virginia. Uh-huh. Yes, ma'am. Zip code? Pardon me? What is your zip code? My what? Your zip code. I cannot hear your you. Address? Can you please speak up, Jenny? I am having an hard time hearing you. Can you please... The zip code for your address? Thank, uh, thank you, Jenny. I can hear you a lot better now. The zip code is... Two, five, three, uh, zero, four. That is the zip code. The telephone number I'm seeing here for you is eight three eight three three eight zero zero three five. Is that correct? Yeah. Would you like to provide me with an email so I can send a welcome package for uh, you? I do not use the email. Your birthday? Uh, what you say? What's your date of birth? My date what? When is your birthday? Oh, my birthday. I was born November 6th. Do you need the year as well? Along with the $100 voucher that I am sending what? out to you. So do you not need the year I was born? You just you, need You can money. provide me if you want, sir. I'm confused. I just want to know what I, I need to give you and what I do not need to give you. You said date of birth. Yes, so. what's your full yes, what's your full date of birth, sir? Oh it is November? the full date of birth. Okay. It is it is November sixth and I was born nineteen seventy nine. So along with the one hundred dollars voucher that we're sending out to you. We're asking you to try discount and savings advantage for $1.95 for 15 days. <coughs> You're also going to save up to 50% online at any of the 4,000 restaurants, online shopping, and much more. If you decide you like the program, you want to stay a member after the 15 days. You do nothing, you would be billed your $44.99 per month. If you decide that it's not for you, call us at any time. You'll not be billed any further. You're getting a $100 voucher. It's yours to keep and spend anywhere of your choice. It does not expire as well, okay? That is for you. Oh, very right? good. So, in order for me to have your award voucher sent out to the address you just provide, you have a Visa or a MasterCard. Oh, what did you say? Do you have a Visa or a MasterCard? Uh, yeah. And does your card expire? Does it what? When does your card expire? 
I'm confused. You're asking for the details of my credit card? Yes, I'm asking you when does your card expire? Isn't, uh, I come to the USA, they say not to give that. There's a lot of fraud over here. They say not to give the uh, credit card over the phone. Why, why are you asking for this? Is there a website I can go put this on, Jenny? I do not feel comfortable putting it on the phone, you know. You've reached this content savings advantage. The number you dial that number has changed or just run the promotion today, right? You're just for participating in the promotion or getting a $100 award voucher. Your only obligation is just a small fee of just $1.95. All that does is simply cover the cost for me to have your award voucher sent out to you. Oh, so it it's is only the fair shipping. promotion only for today, all right? So it is like so the, for the, small the shipping cost for the for the gift for the for the for the card here, yeah. Yes, yeah. So for the small gift, ah, just an hour This makes much more sense. Thank you voucher, so much, Jenny, for explaining this to me. Provide. I would not have been able to understand it if you did not explain it to me there so well. You're so good at explaining, Jenny. I'm asking if you have a Visa or Mastercard well, and when does the card expire? I have a Mastercard. So when does the card expire? Do I need to tell you that that is information on my credit card? I'm told not to give that to people. I can appreciate it for being uncomfortable. Why would you appreciate me being uncomfortable? That means you are happy that I am uncomfortable. Why would you be happy about that, dear? The main reason we do the bill too with these certain types of card here is simply because you're completely protected with these card companies. The script, right? You can't really take that out. So through the federal law called yeah, the yeah. Consumer through Fraud Protection Act, right. it does say that if you and a company were to build something to your card uh, without your yeah. approval, or if we do not send you exactly what we promise. Your card company ah, is so yes, by of course. So you are saying charge. that I can phone my credit card company once you have spent all the money on it, and they will refund it, right? Yes. <laughs> I mean, it sounds about right. So you, so you so expect me to give you my credit card after you just said admitted to that, huh? Sir, can you hear me? Yes. No, no one can charge something to your card without your approval because you're completely protected by your card company, okay? No, anyone can do so that, that a, Anyone, as long as they have my credit card company, details, they can use this credit card, now. It says that if we're in a company, you are to build something to your card without I'm your approval. I am pretty sure you don't have to be a company to use a credit card, dear. I'm pretty sure you just have to have a brain. Or if we don't send you exactly what we promised, your card company is right there. To protect you by allowing you to dispute those charges. Do you not have a brain? The thing is, if you were to do that, it would not only damage your excellent reputation as a company, it would definitely cause us to lose the privilege we yeah, have you must to be, be on able to pilot. our customers. Sounds so tired. So thank you for your time and have a great day, right? Oh, why, why would she hang up after almost 10 minutes? Uh, they are just wasting their time at this point. They do not know what they are doing. This is Steve. How can I assist you? Yes, hello, Steve. Hi, good morning, sir. How can I assist you? Yes, good morning, sir. It said press 1 to claim $100. Can you tell me more about this? Are you calling in to claim the $100 gift card? In order to claim for the gift card, sir, one thing as a customer that you need to take care of from your end, it's just the one-time shipping, handling, and activation fee, which is just going to be $5.95. Oh, Steve, no problem. And you can no use problem. this card. You are blessing me, sir. You are blessing me today with this $100 gift card. This is the least I can do. I will pay for the shipping fees, of course, sir. Of course. Okay, and you can use this card to shop at uh, any of the departmental stores, like Walmart, Kohl's, Target, Best Buy. You can also use it for paying your bills online or making any kind of purchases online. You can use it at your favorite retailers or restaurants. Oh, bless you, you can Steve. Also this use is it. going to be so useful for me. Bless you, Steve. Thank you. May I know your first and last name? My name is Oba Mowu. It is nice to meet you.
<laughs> oh, that's the first person to hang up after hearing my name. Oh, my. <laughs>